Hello there, it is I, Ariman the Exile, and today I am casting you another glorious battle between Blood Angels and Orcs. Alright, let's check it out what happened in this match against uh, insane AI Orcs on the map called Tranquility's End, remastered. And let me tell you, like, I don't know why, but I really kind of enjoy with, to play with uh, Blood Angels. They have that Fallen Primark, Sanguinius, and I would be honored if I saw uh, one Primark called Sanguinius in this beautiful unification mod. But it is what it is. For now we have that what we have, and let's start up this mission. Okay, let's watch from the from the orc perspective. For now. And there we got it. Going out for the salt scouts. They got the salt squads. Those salt squads are pretty interesting models. Yeah, they are looking nice actually. You can see that Sangura in them, in their blood. They are the one space marines you really like, uh, truly like. They are pretty similar to classic space marines, but they are nothing like that. And I oh, hope hey, to boss. see uh, prim Primaris marines with them. What do you want? Incoming oh, some hey, Slaga boys now. From the settlement and the boys hood. Alright, they are going for the generator and for the wall banner. Assault squads are capturing nearest and nearest points and going up for the tactical marine and Captain Tycho. Oh yo, Captain Tycho. <laughs> A truly legend, actually. You will see his shrine, shiny in goldy armor. He he likes gold pretty much, it seems. And there we got it. Some blood angel tactical squad. This this model's got the uh, flamer, plasma gun, melta gun, and a gravitation gun. Those uh, weapons are gravitation gun is only different from those weapons because I will explain you why. Gravitation gun is tier five weapon, and the other We're other other uh, guns like gravitation gun uh, and the melta gun and plasma gun are like tier three. They are, they are tier 3. Flamer is, I believe, tier 1. You have to build only Sanguinius Armory. That's about it. You can always produce Flamer then. Similar to Orcs. Like, Orcs cannot produce... Oh yeah, they can go for the Burnas. Right from the beginning. <laughs> How interesting, actually. They can go for, from uh, beginning to the Burna, Burnas, to, to have some Burna boys. I thought f for some reason they had to have like pile of guns, but no, actually they don't need to have pile of guns. They only need to have uh, produced Slaga boys, a little bit of power, then you can like, go for the Burna boys. Okay, Captain Tycho has arrived, uh, capturing the point from the Orc side it seems and they are well defending it with uh, Captain Tycho and uh, one tactical squad Big Mac a little bit late to this disaster of war look at his leg look at his arm he don't even have one leg but he is still walking like the boss alright now I decided to capture relic and critical location again one critical location oh, hey, will be almost captured. Yeah, it is done. Now some shooter boys have been produced. And they are building pile of guns. What happened with Big Mac? I didn't solve it. He used his Big Mac has been chased by Captain Tycho and his his fellow tactical marines but now they are retreating going in the water with the negative cover as we can see here 
scout marines capturing another critical location. Orcs are like, I don't know, gathering. All of the Slaga boys are now gathered. Going through the waters. From this jungle, in this moment. Another heavy bolter is being produced by Space Marines. And there is no, still, uh, uh, Sanguinius Armory yet. But the Space Marines got two plasma generators. And they have almost built everywhere the listening posts. All of the most of the listening posts are now tier two, and this relic doesn't have one listening post, but I believe it will have it. Scout Marines looking pretty legitimate. Now I believe I am tier. Yes, I have reached tier 2 oh, now. Hey, boss. And the AI got uh, two pile of guns, and they're gonna the do boss. more burner research, which increase flamer. Now shoot up, shoot up boys. Shooting. The big shoot us now. This poor missing post, which is solo. Solo team now. Coming uh, another sergeant with chainsaw. Look at this beautiful model from, from, from sergeant. Chainsaw and both of them. It's like early sergeant. Big Mac lost his complete unit of Slugger Boys now. And the other Slaga boys are just like capturing this critical location. Servitor is coming to probably repair this listening post. They are chasing Big Mac, but it is not a smart solution because Shooter boys are upgraded with Big Shooters now and they do not give a single step to the enemies now. Scouts. Sanguinius Armory has built Sanguinio Armory. Armory is now done. And now we are going for the Victory superior bionics and frag boss. grenades. Interesting stuff. Interesting choice. Now, what is going on now? Finally, this listening post has been built by the servitors on the relic. <laughs> we were talking about it for so long. Now shoot the boys, fully upgraded to shoot the squad, decapping the critical. Uh, they will probably lose a couple of models here. They lost one. They will probably lose a second one, yeah. And maybe even a third one. Yeah. Oh yeah, because that's a plasma gun, ladies and gentlemen. That's a plasma gun. With that plasma gun, they easily took down that orc. Especially when he has like <laughs> a low HP. Six minutes until taken all right, victory. It says now six minutes to control area victory. That means space marines have conquered the most of the critical locations. Incoming two plasma generators more. Almost done the frag grenades. Let's see what's going on from the pile of ones here. More DACA research. Increased damage. For the orcs. Oh, the mech shop. Now it's getting interesting. Going for the mega armor knob. They have reached 65 of the pop. Or cap. And they got some juicy four generators. I like to call them juicy because I always like to like destroy the, the generators from the enemy. <laughs> from my enemies I always Five like to until destroy their stuff. Victory. It feels so nice when you destroy somebody's generator. <laughs> because that is... Uh, everything comes from the economy most of the time. Just, it depends how you well spent your money, you know? 
in these situations of the battle. On the battlefield you have to like really, really play fast. Like there is no, no, like, you cannot like just give your enemies to capture or conquer most of the map. If you do that, you will probably not survive. Insane AIs are always tough. Heavy bolter upgraded with missiles. Shooting the end this war truck. War truck doesn't get really damage for these buildings. Immediately they shoot the boys. But maybe the knobs and mega knobs have something to say about that. Four minutes until the scouts now got combat shotgun. And the sergeant of the scouts got plasma pistol and chainsaw. That is it. Sergeant of the Boom using grenades. Alright. Sergeant of the of the space police is using rally and has a plasma gun with his fellas. The other troops got melter guns and and sergeant. No, all, all of us a big like dead. All of the sergeants got plasma pistol now. And this is the Slaga boy leader, but he is dead. Even the tank busters has been there and they managed to destroy this strategic point turret and like tier 2 will listen post, but tank busters are dead now. Three minutes until we can move One shooter boy, one like knob leader. <laughs> From the shooter squad has survived, but it doesn't matter. He can always reinforce his infantry, right? In calling machine Heliot. <laughs> he is called machine Heliot, but he is servitor. I cannot call him. Different than that. What is this now? Another heavy turret shooting the war truck, dealing a lot of damage, but it's dead. This war truck got half HP now. Scouts in melee against Meganob and the other space marines shooting Meganob. Now they're trying to get this and they have made it. Meganob has made it and the Nobs, but they will die. Probably, yes, they are dead now. Meganob has been like shot hard and thrown by the frag grenades. Tank busters, they are invisible. Oh, we're coming a dreadnought from the space marines now. Going for another knob squad. This is getting interesting. And it's a killer camp. Upgraded with a rocket long time. Alright, it's getting interesting it seems. But the good thing is the blood engine got some melter weapons on and they do not care about vehicles that much and buildings. Building, of course. Now this dreadnought got something to say about building, probably. <laughs> this dreadnought got Melta and Flamer, but it does not have it does not have any upgrades different than that. Furious dreadnought, it's very furious. Okay. Incoming another killer can. And Saga Boy. For some reason, the Drenna from this side is fighting with these knobs. They say knobs are better than small and rotten orcs, but they are still producing slugger boys. <laughs> As a true orc would do. <laughs> Dead Company Rhino, that's not the classic Rhino. Devastator Marines now incoming. And some, some upgrades. Now even we got even a uh, Ecclesium finished and some some it seems some provides and benefits for your commanders probably for Dante and Mephisto yes we have Mr. Mephisto Chief Lothario Mephisto he's the top psycho in the universe of the war game this guy knows how to hold on to his Sorcery, and he also knows how to do his black range. Very good combat. War truck, 
what track is now running, retreating from the crazy Blood Angels. Blood Angels have a lot of it in our going. Sneaky Gritchy Squad preparing this weapon, but will they really? No, they won. Oh, that, that was a big explosion. <laughs> Little Gretchen don't know they are standing against brutal space marine. Incoming another dreadnought, oh my god, I, I think I have researched so much hopcap. Green skins are now like killing with a lot of trouble and pressure for the Blood Angels, it seems. Going out for another dreadnought, there. We are lost! And the research for the for the more benefits we, we have like 140 of the requisition and almost 80 but 79 of the power in the and the 68 of the requisitions from the orcs i don't know the names, what they want to do here and 66 generating power the space marines pretty much pretty now i even got some veteran squad Building power swords in their hands and the plasma ones. They don't really care about it. It's time for, for the orcs to die, they say. Our truck completely disabled. Six minutes to control our victory. Kill a can. We'll try to do something against this brutal force of the space marines, but no, not really. The pistol leading his brethren. Servitors building everything in the only critical location in the middle has not captured by no one now. Right now, mega armor knot. And he's coming from Spider Boy. Mega armor knot solo to cover up his force. <laughs> Get lost, Mega Armor Knot. Yep. Get lost, it seems. Orcs are dying pretty easily now. Going up for another Mega Knot. They lost that generator. They will lose another. And the settlement is you. Losing very fast HP, like the Space Marines are activated. And that's about it from this match. Space Marines have, yeah, we can see some Devastator squad in the background with a lot of heavy bolters. Yeah, heavy bolters and the missiles are for this fellas, for the Devastator Marines, it seems. They also got the Plasma Cannon and the Last Cannon as a Bale Fortress as a tier 4 weapon or tier 3, I'm not sure, but that's about it. Space Marines has completely crushed Orcs. It took me like 70 minutes and 9 seconds. Now let's see uh, one more thing before we end this. <laughs> okay, we got military 1000 my bad 114 uh, of the kills from the space marines blood angels 32 unit lost 70 building demolished 3 building lost from the space marines in resources we had better economy in every way possible except for the power gathering for some reason ai's know how to like gather power really quick technology yeah, we are better in almost every way except for the reinforcement. They had 37 and we had 36. We have managed to capture more stuff on the map than the, than the orcs. And that is why we won. Alright. If you did like this, uh, leave a comment if you would like to see more stuff like this. Uh, and uh, I hope I will see your comments in the next episode. Guys, stay tuned. The Emperor protects.